Hey guys, Ricardo here. Welcome to another Blog Tech Tips. And of course, today guys, I'm going to show you to stop iTunes from asking for a password each time you try to look at or install a app. All right. And of course, you can check out here. This is what the issue looks like. So if I just go in and try to install any app, you'll notice that it will ask for the password. And of course, this is just to protect you. But in some cases, not necessary, especially if you do not have a credit card associated. All right. So in that case, let's go ahead. As you can see here, I'm demonstrating the issue. So as you see, we're trying to install this app. And if I hit install right here, you'll notice it asks for the Apple ID. And of course, this can be very annoying, especially if you can't really remember the Apple ID all the while or be bothered to put it in. So in that case, on your iPhone, just go ahead and go to settings. And you can find the settings app. It's right here. Or you can find it somewhere on screen, depending on where you see yours is stored. Just go to settings. Once in settings, guys, you're going to go to the option that says iTunes and App Store. So from the top, just scroll down and you'll find it right around here. And you can just go into the option. Once you're in the option here, next, you're going to look for the option that says password settings. And it should be in this menu. So just look around. It should be at the top of the menu. So if we go back to the top of the menu, you should see the option. So let's go up here. And here's the option it says password settings let's go ahead and select and it should be just below your apple id and of course it says required password and there's a toggle toggle sorry let's go ahead and hit the toggle and it should prompt you for the password as you're going to see here and from here just simply re-enter the password and of course once you enter the password it will stop from um, asking you in the future so you can just go ahead and install apps without needing the password and of course guys i'm um, just demonstrating here and once you do that you can just um, follow from here and that should solve the problem and as you can see i've done mine off screen and the problem is now gone if i go back to the app store and try to install apps it will not require the password all right guys this is ricardo Gardner from blog tips until next time bye